Welcome to Roaming Rebels. This is episode 2 of our vlog covering Fui Island. If you missed episode 1, you will find the link in the description below. This episode, we're just taking you on the ride, on the bike with us. It's just a lot of off-road, a lot of beautiful scenery, small little fishing villages. It's like time stood still and we're taking you on this ride. Lots of wind. We survived. We even swam in a very hectic ocean, but we're still here to, uh, to tell the tale. So please watch it through to the end, subscribe, like, share and comment and remember to click the notification bell to stay up to date. We found uh, a military area with a sealed up bunker, we sort of half unsealed it and then we realized that the size of the bunker inside meant that there was other entrances. So we tracked up the side of the mountain with pluckies and shorts and we found another sealed entrance. This is sand, well not sand yet, this is dried coral that will turn into sand. I'm going to show you guys a surreal restaurant in the middle of the jungle. As you can see by the footage, uh, there is no developments around us. It's really in the bush. If you don't know where to drive or how to get here, you'll never find it.
I see down in the in the gully, the pools, is a floating restaurant. Uh, the ponds on the furthest away from the opposite end of the restaurant is is quite deep. The ponds house between crayfish, um, snapper fish, uh, sea snails, a whole variety of seafood. That the owner then dives into the pool with with goggles, holding his breath catches the item that you want to eat live, it goes to his kitchen, they cook it the way you want it, and then you sit on that little floating restaurant and you consume your seafood. You must see this place when it's high tide and the waves come crashing over that, that opposite end of the wall. It's raining here, <laughs> the waves are all clashing on the other side. Woo! <laughs> it's wet, wet, wet. <laughs> Goodness, the phone is a little bit waterproof. That is so cool. This is a fish farm. Huh? This is so cool. This is a 95 year old uh, that passed away and since she is a mother, a grandmother, a great grandmother, a huge amount of family so they will take her to her last uh, resting place. Let's go. 
Thank you for watching to the end. And see you next week, Sunday.